fire has always been a part of nature in Florida. And most species are not only adapted for it, they depend on it for survival. Each spring and summer, wildfires ignited by lightning would sweep across the state, burning away dense vegetation and allowing new seeds to grow. Today, because of highways, homes and businesses, and public safety, such wildfires can no longer be allowed to burn freely. St. John's River Water Management District land managers conduct periodic prescribed fires as a safe way to apply a natural process to ensure ecosystem health, to meet the needs of many plants and animals, while also reducing the threat of wildfires. Prescribed fire is used to reduce hazardous fuel buildups, thus providing increased protection to people, their homes, and the forest. Other uses include disease control in young pines, wildlife habitat improvement, range management, preservation of endangered plant and animal species, and the maintenance of fire-dependent ecosystems. Fox squirrels, gopher tortoises, scrub jays, red cockaded woodpeckers, wire grass, and longleaf pines are just a few of the many species that depend on fire. Prescribed fire is one of the most versatile and cost-effective tools land managers use. Prescribed fire is a way to use a natural process to ensure ecosystem health and to reduce the risk of wildfires. Each year the district tries to do about 50,000 acres of prescribed fire and that enables us to do things like maintain ecosystems for listed species like pitcher plants, scrub jays, red cockaded woodpeckers. It's an important tool, and in some ecosystems, it's almost as essential as rain and sunshine. 